I think that versatility in the character. I think he's the best Shoto right now. I I, I would say I think it's him or Akuma. I think he's the best Shoto. Wow. I really I do More, I do better believe than that. Ryu? I think he's better than Ryu. I think he's better. I, I without a doubt Biased. I I am Biased. no I am following Biased Logan's opinion. coattails because Logan <laughs> shout outs to Logan. Logan was like Ryu not Ryu. He said Ken is the best Shoto right now and I believe it. Firmly, I do not deny it. Okay, who's who's placed further? All right, my my Ken did really good. I'm about to see Chris T do really good. All right, Ken's out here. Excuse me, did we not just earlier talk about a Kage qualifying for Capcom Cup? Has a Ken qualified yet? Anyways, it's about to happen. <laughs> it's about to happen. Chris T and Chris Filipino man. Let's Filipino see what man. these two friends have to say to each other here. Let's see what they have to say. Uh, over a decade of intense Street Fighter has been played between us. Nothing but respect to Anton. A classic showdown of two kids that had a dream to be legendary in this business. That warms my heart. Feels. <laughs> That's so good. That's like, the feels. This, is, this is the best friend moment where, wow, we really got to fight each other. I mean, again, you know, I, I make those jokes about being a dad or whatever, but I saw these, the, both of these players when they first started showing up to Wednesday Night Fights. Yeah. And I've always been so happy to oh, see no how no. strong. <laughs> I've always been so happy to see yeah. how strong both of them have gotten. Let's yeah. see what Filipino Man has to say. Yeah. Chris Tatarian versus the Filipino Man is a timeless classic beginning in the early SF4 days. It should hopefully be another good set. On the topic of SF4 days, it's been 10 years since my best Rose player friend, Sku 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 222, passed. And I will try my best to win for him with Rose. That, oh, wow. That's, oh, no. Re rest in peace. That is, that is hard. And it, whenever you lose a friend, it, it really gives you that motivation to be the best version of yourself. And the fact that he still plays Rose yeah. and lets that fire burn, you know, I want that soul sprout. Christy, I love Ken, but Filipino man, you got to take it. I, he, he, won my, it. he won my heart. <laughs> Sorry. Rose is the best Shoto in the game. I want to see. I want to see. Is Rose a show? Filipino man, dude. I mean, look, <laughs> no. all, I'm, Terry's a show. Is Terry a show? Uh, uh, Kazuya's a show. Kazuya's yeah. a show. <laughs> <laughs> um, anyways, uh, I mean, I, I, I do want to see because Rose is one of those characters that you know we don't get to see as much yeah. in the CPT event. So, dude, they're even going with this. Looks like Alpha One. That's what they're I love to see. Going with all the classic costumes here, and even that's a classic rose color as well. So we're playing Street Fighter Alpha. For one over here. Yeah, really good stuff. And again, this is winner's top 16, so it is only going to be a first to two. Winner is going to not be playing for the rest of the day, and the loser will have a chance in the loser bracket. But Chris T immediately putting the pressure on fire. Mm. Oh, no. Ooh. Yep, and there's that V skill too. <laughs> and that's the nice thing about that is it gives him that kind of frame trap opportunity. And it looks like Chris T is just going to start off with a perfect. perfect. Wow, that was. That was a dominating set, and really, like you said, showing off the power of the V skill two. You're like, is he gonna go strike? Is he gonna throw a throw? And the overhead just keeps coming out off the of V skill yeah. two, and that came off of one fireball. That momentum where he got the one knockdown off fireball, and it was over. But now, great tech on the throw. Filipino man gonna be trying his best to fight back. Yeah, and one of the tricky things about oh. this match that you're gonna that we're <laughs> not that we're not going to see here is the fact that these two players know so much about each other that a lot of the decisions that they're making are going to come from years of playing against each other. Yeah. So there's going to be a lot of interesting uh, decisions made by them, and we'll probably not as understand them as well as they will. Yeah. I really like that Filipino man is a opting to play at this distance. Now oh, charging what a v in. V reversal that was beautiful. Yeah. It's really smart. Just don't give him that ability to get the offense going at yeah. all. Ooh. You don't need that meter for a V trigger comeback at this point. So no chance. Just V reversal everything Ooh. now. Nice EX soul spiral through, and now playing at full screen. But Filipino man has such a hill to climb. Christy doesn't have to do anything here. Yep, and that's why he's just chilling there. Why, and you yep. see it as soon as he had the chance. Oh, again. V reversal, but look at this. Filipino man slowly making his way back. Yeah, he's almost dead. He's been losing chip damage here and there. Oh boy. The whiff throw, but no punish from Chris T. Oh, and this is going to be incredibly close. Too far. Too far. So good. Okay. The gray health here means one good touch from Chris T. Will kill Filipino man there, but it's 15 seconds on oh, the clock. What is this? And now there Filipino you go, man win. has a lead. He has gotten the lead. Like I said, he was chipping away, and maybe the little bit of tentative play right there from Chris T. Ooh. Not a good idea. The satellite. Because he's got ah. satellite's V reversal. He's got one big oh. nice block on the other. Ah, the jump of the mm. fireball. You got to be kidding me. Two seconds, Filipino mm. man. The turtle versus the beast. I mean, 
the crazy thing was, I mean, it wasn't even turtling for most of that round, right? I mean, Chris was the one trying to play defensive, yeah. trying to finish it off with the V reversals and such. But Ooh. then Filipino man with the comeback. <laughs> oh, oh no! And there is one of the uh, inconsistencies. The, yeah, the inconsistencies with Ken that I think was introduced recently. Oh. Here this is go. so hard. How do you approach now? Ah, what? Do what a juggle confirm. off the wall and do a juggle. Just needs one more hit and you are out. And Chris uh. T with a little bit of desperation. And, 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 and frankly, I feel like that previous round yeah. was so much in Chris T's mind because uh, he he didn't. I don't feel like he played himself that round. No. I don't feel like he played himself as like like himself that round at all. What I would have liked to see from Chris T in that round because the aggression is what got him the perfect in the first round. Mm -hmm. Why are you playing full screen? You know that you're able to overrun him, call him out on the throws, and like get the right read on the situation. Why not do it again? You needed one more touch to make it happen, but so afraid to move forward. And Anton, he's like, okay, I'll play a full screen game. I'm Rose. <laughs> and Anton was able to turn it around from perfect to lose in the first game. That's rough. And now this is the Chris T we wanted yeah. to see again. This is what she's, what you've got to do. Rose, obviously a character not with great defense either. So no. nice confirm. Caught him standing and also just single hit confirm cool. there. Tried to shimmy, but that's why you come out with those buttons. Yep. But Chris T again with this offense. Oh, man. What? Yeah, big crush counter. Sweet. And again, confirm off to the... Standing short into the e into the DP, so good. And again, a great round from Chris T, but we saw him moving forward. And when you play Ken, I feel like you got to rush now. Mm -hmm. You have to. Can't let her establish the soul satellites and no. such. Oh, very good. Oh, look at that. Nice link. Very Chun-Li-esque right there. Ooh. God, the range that she has on some of those buttons is so good. Yeah, and I really like this change in tempo from Filipino from Filipino Man, really going on the offensive and then backing up. Full screen Tatsu, easy punish. Goes for the meaty, Ooh. and then this mini shimmy right there. Caught him low. Nice cool. tech. So stopping that momentum oh, right there. Okay, here we go. Going to save a little bit of that meter, not Ooh. go for the full one. Oh no, that's not enough to kill yet. If you had gone for the EX Soul Spiral, it might have been enough. Yeah, but this is so scary. You can't make any mistakes here as Chris T. You right. gotta deal with the fireballs, the satellites. There it is. Mm. Was probably looking for the throw, but it was not present. Double low, we'll get the round on the board. But Chris T saved all of his resources. Still yeah. has a full bar. Felt like he wasn't gonna use any of those resources there. So this is anybody's game here. Ooh, nice check with the standing heavy kick Ooh. to catch him while he was jumping. Preemptive space controlling. Ooh. Wow, and then even reading the V skill and getting the EX soul charge through it. This is so good for Filipino man right now, even though Chris has the resources. Okay, here we go. Oh, this is huge. You're in the corner. V trigger is available. This nice is how Chris off. wins, is this corner position. But here comes Filipino man now, trying to fight his way out. Ooh, what a confirm right there, calling out the V skill. Now this is so scary. Utilize the resources. V-Trigger is active, but the activation station we're okay, going in. And Vamos. he's got the meter. If he can monot his way through this and get dead? to the super, no it way. should be kill. Is this going to kill? Is it going to kill? Freeze the frame. I think he... No, not dead, not dead. Not enough yet. You just lost all those Ooh. channel points, dude. Any touch will kill Chris T here. Activation. Oh, okay, the okay, here we go. Here we go. Chris, time for the comeback. Ooh. Trying to even up the game. V reversal, v -reversal get off me. Gets the knockdown, yeah. And he would punish with challenging oh, with the fireball. Yeah. You're scary. Ooh. He's got an offensive. Actually, no, I'm sorry. It's Anton that has the V reversal on deck. Now, what can Chris do, though? He has to make it through the, the shmup right here. He He's has to take a one. risk. He has to fight the bullet hell at this point. And Anton is totally oh. comfortable just doing this. Oh, other. no! He went for it. He went for the Hail Mary. He said, if I hit you, I win. And if I don't, I die. You know, I'd rather die by the sword than live without fighting. And Chris D really showed up. Mm. He, he had the perfect in the first round. It looked so convincing, but Filipino Man really slowed it down. As soon as he got a lead, he just created that distance. And you saw that. As soon as Ken was in that compromised situation, he had to take a risk, no matter what the risk ended up being, to get the hit. And Anton yeah. knew that. That. Filipino man smelt blood in the water and was like, all right, I'm going to let you do it to yourself. I'm going to walk forward, block. You're going to DP. That's what Ken's do. That's the flow chart. <laughs> I've read the flow chart. I've known you for 10 years. You wrote it with me. <laughs> and Filipino man will not be playing anymore today, but we will see more Chris T action a little bit later. As you can see, top eight on the top of the winner side is already decided. We're going to see Panda Nephew versus Filipino man tomorrow.